Indian tree and creature has a name, and this one's called Pocahontas for the Game Boy. It's a tree in that you want to start a fire with it. It's a rock in that it feels like it's been tied to your feet and is slowly pulling you deeper and deeper into the Hudson River. And it's a creature in that it has to kill to survive and seems to have a will of its own. It was spawned, I mean, it was released in 1996 from whence it disappointed children from coast to coast. From the hidden pine trails of the forest to the sun sweet berries of the earth which isn't even a place but see that's the thing about pocahontas for the game boy the damn thing was so evil it spread to places that aren't even places at all because see it's all connected in a circle in a hoop that never ends anyway this is a platformer kind of you, you play as pocahontas or at least you try to play as Pocahontas, and you platform. Or at least you try to platform. Usually there's some minor puzzle solving elements, so you have to switch to Miko, the raccoon, who might have to shovel boulder for Pocahontas, you know, because raccoons are so strong. But don't worry, because Pocahontas has to return the favor by dropping logs in the water phrasing, so the raccoon can cross. Because it's not like raccoons can swim or anything. And hey, when Pocahontas is swimming, the graphics are marginally better than Snake for your Nokia flip phone. Looks like it's too late, Pocahontas. The white man's already polluted your rivers. It's like a... It's already a black and lifeless wasteland down there. Hey, maybe that's why Miko can't swim. Water's so bad that any raccoon that touches it gets possessed by the devil. He's singing with 666 voices of the wind. Of the wind. Out that demon possession is not this game's biggest problem. No, far more problematic than even that is the gameplay. Controlling Pocahontas is not easy. Just ask her dad. She doesn't even listen to him. Well, you think you're gonna tell her what to jump on? Yeah, good luck with that. She's a free spirit, that one. Like her mother before her. This game's so freaking stiff. Which would make sense, except Pocahontas is not Belle. Which would be a terrible, awful thing to say. Except that Pocahontas is a terrible, awful video game. It's the interactive equivalent of a stutter. You know, because it's really trying to make its point, but it's impossible to make anything out. It, it must have been developed by the Virginia Company, because all they wanted is to get rich, so they made a Pocahontas game. And they didn't care what they destroyed to do so, or what they cut down, or where they pooped. See, what I love most about toilets is, you can't poop in the same toilet twice. The water's always changing, always flowing. And actually, the worst part is that it's bad gameplay and bad design coming together to ruin everything. Like the late 90s in Disney, it came together and everything was ruined. Like, look at this crap. You have to climb these limbs, right? Which would be bad enough with these awful controls, but it's also super particular, like where you have to do it. And also, you have about three steps worth of space to run and jump from on the limbs. So this happens all the time. And that's the other thing. When Pocahontas falls, she falls straight down. You can't turn or twist or fall back onto the limbs below you. Nope, all the way back down. Hey, Pocahontas, it's not the wolf crying to the blue corn moon, you little bitch. It's me killing the damn thing. You know, it's amazing how far Disney games had fallen by this point. The, the days of games like DuckTales and Darkwing Duck and Rescue Rangers and Castle of Illusion, those days were over. Now we had these days. We had Pocahontas for the Game Boy. And I guess there's a console version too. I don't know. I've never played it. And after dealing with this crap, I'm probably not going to. So Pocahontas is just a bad platformer, you guys. Although her hair is pretty flawless. It's Pocahontas! the original Game Boy. Thanks to our very good friend and dear pal, Chris, from Jersey City, New Jersey, for sending this crap to the show. Look, I'm a huge Disney fan. I'm a Disney mega fan. But, but this is just a bad platformer, you guys. Bad raccoon, too.